A desire to help rural women find their voice led Catherine Marriott to establish her company, Influential Women. I spoke to Catherine a short time ago about the role women can play in promoting the beef industry. This year, I was lucky enough to be involved with the Rural Industries Research and Development Corporation's Rural Women's Award. And as a successful applicant for Western Australia, I launched a company called Influential Women. So, watching the live trade ban unfold last year and the powerlessness of producers, they had no voice. The voice that they had was starting from a position of defence. And as far as I'm concerned, that's no place to start a conversation. So, I wanted to provide a platform for women who were desperate to contribute to the conversation to come and learn media skills, learn self-awareness to gain confidence and step up and share agricultural stories. Women are amazing storytellers so I'm absolutely proud of all the women that I've had come through and the stories and the resulting media coverage that they've got. It's just brilliant. I often get asked, you know, Catherine, we don't have the money that Animals Australia have and, you know, one thing that we do have is attitude and determination and passion, but we also have social media. I personally have just started using Twitter and I now have over 650 followers, so it's an amazing conduit to get information out there. Most people in the cities use Twitter on a daily basis. Farmers find it a little bit confronting, so it's about breaking down the barriers and realising that it's not frightening and it's an amazing opportunity to communicate with your consumer. So it's, social media has a huge role to play. Influential Women, I started it to empower women from the beef industry. And what I found was, I, my inaugural launch in Broome last year, I had women from the cotton industry, the sheep industry, the dairy industry, the beef industry, the tourism industry. So it doesn't matter what industry you're from, women are really excited about learning more about themselves and being able to have a voice. So it doesn't matter what industry you're from, women have got stories inside them that they're desperate to get out, and influential women gives them the capacity to do that. One example of a project, I've just recently come back from Indonesia where we took the first ever women's delegation to Indonesia. So all girls, there was five from pastoral stations, all small family owned businesses and five industry women and we were so well received. But the gift that it gave these women was the capacity to speak and share stories from their experience, from their heart because they'd been there and seen it. So when you have experience in something, you can then speak with integrity. And that's the gift that these women get. It's just amazing.